Welcome back once again to GH Electrical Engineer. I trust you're all living well, whatever you find yourself. At the four corners of the planet, I know you are making their gradual plans just to make your dream to becoming reality in lovely continent called Africa. Guys, it's a quick brief update with a very lovely client who really having a very, very good relationship with us. Good relationship with us. He, he got a very good transmissions on his side and we are coming to work here uh, for three different sections three different sections we are working on the swimming pool and then the, the, the compound plumbing work and also later on we'll be coming to the electrical work and as i said it earlier on in my video design before you build this client got a very very lovely design and it's not only the lovely design he got very good transmissions as you can see this is the main building he got a two lovely garage right here as you can see them and then he got very good transmission as you can see this building right here is just a two stores and then one bedroom apartment one bedroom apartment on the upstairs he got he got the person got living area if you got your kitchen and then one bedroom in suit with your toilet and your washroom and then the bell building for the client we really having a lovely swimming pool right here we got a lovely lovely design lovely lovely design as you can see in right here we've got a septic tank the back of the septic tank you can see lovely swimming pool right there okay without wasting more time we are done with the swimming pool let us go to the swimming pool side and check it out and then later on we're working out with our our plumbing work as usual those who really follow our our channel know how to do our plumbing work we got a, a lovely lovely video based on our plumbing work and based on our, our electrical design so in plumbing work we're not going to talk much about the plumbing work because in those who follow our previous video we get to know the concept about our, our plumbing work because we got a lovely lovely code we use for our plumbing work we we, we got we, we got ipc and upc ips mean, means what IPC mean international plumbing code and the UPC mean universal plumbing code that is the most of the code that we mostly use them for our plumbing work so with that guys we without waste more time let, let's go to the swimming pool and check something a little quick about our lovely swimming pool as you can see let, let, let me show a bit about our plumbing work lovely lovely plumbing work though who follow my channel used to know gh electrical engineer when it come back to the design i'm one of the best both electrical work and plumbing work the guy is giving their best industrially persistently they are giving their best for every client there's a lovely pool as you can see let me go right here and give the picture of the pool very lovely pool not too much big not too much big very lovely pool we got a schema right here so let, 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 me, let me give you a little quick about uh, the update about plumbing work and then we came back um later on today the the, the 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 swimming pool as you can see let me explain it a little quick we got a three different section line right here. One line is going to be a toilet drainage, which is a tea drainage. One line is going to be a sewage drainage, which is a, the, the washroom, the, um, the kitchen, the basin. That, that, that one is also got a one drainage. And then this drainage used to be a six inches for the compound drainage. 
so that is what we are trying to plot them right here it's a compound drainage my guys is really working industrially just to bring the best to each of um, every client of gh electrical engineer so when we are done with this we are going to continue on to working out with our electrical system so without wait more time let's go to the pool and so so that i can give you a little quick update about the pool this lovely pool got everything we have a jet we have a spy area and we have the main pool this is the main pool area all this place is the main pool area and then right here we got a spy area right here so only we got a two retains for the spy and we got a one drainage we haven't done it yet so this pool as you can see right here it's a schema let's go close to it if you haven't seen anything or if you see something something like this on the pool is a schema this schema it shows the water level of the pool your pool water level because it's, it's a main essential point of the pool because the water level this schema is going to show the water level of the pool and not only that we got pool returns each of the corner of the pool we have pool return right there especially this one is a pool retains you also got another pool retain right here you also got another pool retain right there on the corner you also had a pool retain right here all pool retains will push any debris or any dust or any leaves that fall into the surface of the water it pushes them throughout the schema because we are in Ghana sometimes even when the, 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 the water wanted to when the, 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 they wanted to rain it wanted to rain in Ghana it, it come with a, a lot of air and a lot of air you see people pool there, there must be a dax there, there, there must be a couple of debris it, it, it must be a leaves when the leaves fall into the surface of the water this pool returns will drag them throughout the schema and it push throughout the schema and go to the basket and then it passed through the filtration system. That filtration system will keep your pool clean. So this is a typical design. We are not going to explain all the component, but at least component that we got, like we have a two inlet, we got a four different retains, and then we got a schema. We also got a main drain to keep the pool clean. We also got something that we call it vacuum. Vacuum is what? Sometimes in the, in the pool, when you have a vacuum, vacuum clean the pool most. So that is what we design our pool retain. We have done it. So this is a, we got an engine room right here. If you can see this side, that was the engine room. That is where we are going to put all the pool pump, the filtration system. You're going to be something right here, a little quick, something just to cover this place. And then we are going to put the pool retains and the um, filtration system all of them right here so that is for the design and this the main pool we are going to have it through different lighting as you can see we have almost put the links there we have put all the allowance right there and the jet where we are going to place our jet we also put another one light right there it's going to be a very lovely pool just it's a small pool very cute pool but it's going to be a lovely lovely pool and we are working on the um, the plumbing work as you can see i explain i explain in in my previous video how we do our plumbing work we are not just a plumber we we design before we do it and i said in each of my video design before you build design before you build as you can see we got a three different sections as i explain it Three different sections. One section is a WT drainage, which is a toilet drainage. One section is sewage drainage. Sewage drainage, 
is the drainage from the washroom, basin, uh, kitchen, all of the in, in shower, every shower in your house, that was a one drainage, and another drainage is going to be your toilet drainage. And then the extra drainage, as you can see it right here, is a drainage that is going to be under your compound, just helping the water system on your compound to drain it into the gutter. So that is what we are doing right here. We are going to bring you more updates. I see GH, I'm there, I'm working industrially, bringing the best to my client. We got a different, different video, but this is a live video coming from our lovely client who really have a very, very good relationship with us. So, um, as usual, guys, I'm not going to waste more time. As usual, like, subscribe, hit the notification bell so that you always be aware when GH releasing the new video. You will not miss out. Guys, I will see you next time. Guys, Yebeshia.